Hi, the purpose of this video is to walk you through the process that you'll need to take to upload your files, your assignment files, to Blackboard. Um, now, I've already logged into Blackboard, and so I just need to access our course. So I'll select that. And in this particular course, all of your assignments will be found under the Assignments uh, button. So you'll select that. And uh, let's say that I want to submit the assignment for uh, this first PowerPoint assignment. So I'm going to select that assignment, which will open up the assignment view where you can uh, read the instructions. This is what you, know, you need to complete. You'll read these pages. You'll complete this exercise on these pages. Um, and then have the due date and then the points possible. All of our assignments will have a points possible of 100. So there's really nothing, nothing's going to change there. So um, let's assume that I've already gone through and I've read the chapter, worked through those exercises, and I've completed the capstone, and I'm ready to submit the assignment. So I'll just go to the Browse My Computer link, which will open up my computer browser, you know, the Windows Explorer, so that I can um, browse uh, the hard drive or, or flash drive or whatever. Um, so I'm going to go over there. I'm going to select the folder that the files are in. And let's say I'm submitting this uh, particular file right here. I'll select Open. Now it'll show here that the file has been um, added to the Attach File window. If you need to attach another file, many of our assignments will have multiple files that need to be uploaded. Um, you should try to upload them all at the same time. But if not, we'll talk about um, how you would do that um, in just a second. So to, to add a second file, I just repeat that process, click Browse My Computer. Um, let's say I'm going to do this handout, click Open. Now that added both of those files to um, the attached file area. Now at this point, they're not uploaded. We have not uploaded the files to Blackboard. We've just uh, gotten them ready to, to be uploaded. So down at the bottom of your screen, you'll see you have two, uh, well really three options. You have Cancel, which would cancel what you just did if you're just want to start over. Um, save as draft. What that does is that saves what you've done so that you can go back in and, and add additional files. Um, so if, if I wanted to do that, let's say that, that there were two capstone exercises due that week for that assignment and I've done one of them and I want to go ahead and upload it so that um, you know I don't forget or, or whatever. You would hit that save as draft button which would allow you to uh, to save the, the parts that you've already completed. So I click OK. And then, you know, let's say a couple days later, I come back and I want to uh, add some more files. I go back to the PowerPoint, to that assignment. Um, I, you can see the two files that I added previously. So if I wanted to add a third, I would click Browse My Computer, um, select that one, click Open. Now I'm ready to submit the entire assignment. Uh, I would just go down here and click the Submit button. And it uploads the files to Blackboard. You'll get a Review Submission History option. Make sure that the files that you want to add are shown here. Um, I'll get a notification that it needs to be graded. I like to grade things you know, kind of as they come in. Um, it makes my life easier and you get you know, pretty much immediate feedback. So, um, but you know, most in some cases, it, it, your grades won't get done, or your assignments won't get graded until after the due date has passed. Um, but if I get a chance, I will grade things early. Um, so click OK, and that's it. You've successfully completed uh, the assignment. Your files have been uploaded, and you're ready to go. If you have any questions about this process, please uh, email me through Blackboard, and I'll get back to you as soon as I can.